Hi there, I'm Jesse Kurtz in the Mountain West Network Studio here with a check on the headlines in the Mountain West with your Mountain West Daily for Thursday, October 20th. Utah State men's basketball standout Jalen Moore is one of 20 small forwards in the nation who has been named to the Julius Irving Small Forward of the Year Award watch list. Moore, who is a preseason All-Mountain West selection this year, has led the Aggies in scoring and rebounding in each of the past two seasons. He's coming off a junior campaign in which he averaged 15.2 points and six rebounds per game. San Jose State women's soccer standout Dee Dee Hoppius will become the program's first active student athlete to lace up internationally when she competes for her native German national team at the 2016 FIFA U20 Women's World Cup in Papua New Guinea. Proud to like wear um, the jersey and like sing the national anthem and I don't know, like be competing with the best players in the world. Hoppius received the great news last week during her fifth trip back home in the last year for training with the U-20 German national team. The global tournament begins on November 13th, immediately after the 2016 Mountain West Women's Soccer Tournament, where San Jose State is the defending champion. UNLV will honor an all-time legend at Saturday's football game against Colorado State. National Football Foundation and College Football Hall of Famer Randall Cunningham will be at Sam Boyd Stadium for an NFF Hall of Fame on-campus salute between the first and second quarter of the game. Cunningham, who broke 18 UNLV records including career passing yards, touchdown passes, and punting average, will be inducted into the College Football Hall of Fame in December. Make sure you tune in to ESPN tonight at 8.15 Mountain Time to catch 14th ranked Boise State take on BYU. The Broncos have won 22 games in a row against non-conference opponents at home, a win streak that dates all the way back to 2005. From the Mountain West Network Studio, I'm Jesse Curtis.